Tennessee into course algebra one, question number five. They want to order numbers from greatest to least. Now, there's a few ways that you can do them. You can just convert them all into, since they're generally all the same numbers, I'm going to convert them all into decimals. Now I'm doing greatest to least, so I just make a little uh, chart and put them in order. 1.8 would be the greatest. Uh, 1.75 would come next, because you're looking down, so all of them start with 1. And then you look at the second number, or the tenths place. 8 is bigger than 7, so 7 comes in. Then you have to look at the hundredths place. In this case, the seven, uh, five, the 5 is bigger than the 3. And then you just redo their values on the side. So this would be 13 over 8, this would be the square root of 3, this is 1.75, and this is 9 over 5. So that's one way to do it, and then you just find the one that matches. Um, it's right here. Uh, also, so the answer for number 5 is D. You could also do it in a list. Now the list on my calculator is a little bit different probably than yours, uh, unless you're using a TI-73. I'm going to delete all these out real fast some old work I've been working on. So I do 13, oops, 13 eighths, square root of 3, and see it converted it, so I have to remember that it's there, and then 1.75, and then 9 over 5. And then I'm going to put them in greatest, so I need to hit second and quit, then I need to go second stat, Go over to ma uh, to ops, which is operations. Sort D. It, this question says greatest to least, so that means it's going down, which is a descent. So sort D means sort descending. Go into list, hit L1. Now it's and hit enter to say done. Go back to my list, and it has nine fifths, 1.75. I have to remember that 1.73205080 is the square root of three equivalent, and then uh, 13 over eight. So it gives me the answer that I was looking for. So that's how you do number five.